In this video, I'll show you how to fix your printer not printing. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. I'll be running through multiple different fixes, so make sure you watch this full video so you understand them all. So firstly, just do the obvious things like making sure your printer is all connected correctly. And then what you should do is fully turn your printer off and then turn it back on. Then once you've done that, what I recommend doing is uninstalling your printer and then reinstalling it on your computer. You may be wondering how you can do that well I'll show you. So the first thing you need to do is come to the bottom of Windows and go and tap on search and what you need to do and what you need to search is printers and devices just like this or printers and scanners it should take you straight here. Then once you're here you can also get here just by coming to your settings and pressing on Bluetooth and devices and then tapping on printers and scanners. Then what you need to do is find the printer that you're having the problems with which in this case is my Canon printer so I'd then go and tap on it. Then once you've gone and selected it, all you then need to do is go and tap on remove like so, and then just go and press yes, just like so. And there we go, it's now gone and removed it. Then once you've gone and removed it, we then want to go and add it again. So to do that, all you need to do is go and tap on add device, just like so. And then it's gonna go and search for printers. As you can see, it's found mine. So I'll then go and tap on add device on the right hand side, and it's now connecting to it. And hopefully that will go and fix the problem. The next thing we can try is resetting the printer spooler. And you may be wondering what is the printer spooler? Well, it's basically the thing that manages the printing process on your computer. So what we need to do is first to go and open up our services. To do that, go and tap on search at the bottom and go and type in services, just like so it should appear and wait for it to launch. Then once we're in it, we need to scroll down until we can go and see printer spooler. Um, it's gonna be in alphabetical order, so it should be quite easy to go and find. And here it is just here. Then what you want to do is right click on it and go and press stop like so. I'll take a moment to do this. The next thing you need to do is go into the description of this video and you need to go and look for something which looks like this. And I'm gonna go and sort of label it. Um, but yeah, it'll look something like this, percentage win at DIR. And what you want to do is highlight it and copy it just so it looks like this. Then once you've got it, go and put it into your search. So go and tap on search and then go and right click and press paste just like so. And as you can see, we then need to go and tap on this file here or folder I should say. And then what you'll need to do is go and tap on continue like so and it should take a moment and make sure that this is empty. You need to go and delete everything in this folder. So what you can do is just drag down and highlight it. As you can see, I've already recently emptied it, which is why I haven't got it. Or alternatively, you can press control A and like that, and it's gonna highlight everything. Then you can right click on it and go and press delete or press the delete key on your keyboard. So make sure that's empty. Then once you've emptied it, come back to your services here. If you've gone and um, closed this window, just go and search for services again. Then find printer spooler, right click on it again and go and press start. To Go and start it up again. And after you finish that, then what you should do is just go and restart your whole computer. So go and tap on the Windows button in the bottom left, like so, press on the power button, and then go and tap on restart and restart your computer. And hopefully that will go and fix the problem. If it has, please consider leaving a like. Peace.